Hi everyone and welcome to NameHero.com. I want to make a little announcement here to our YouTube channel and social media community. You can now buy web hosting and domain registrations from us using Bitcoin. I just made the announcement here on the blog and I'll also be releasing a formal press release later this week or sometime here this month. Um, but if you scroll down here, you can um, learn the news. We just reactivated our Coinbase merchant account. So you have to have an account with Coinbase to be able to, um, to do this. Um, but now you can do it with, um, for your web hosting and domain registrations. So I'm going to give a little bit of history about my, or give you a little bit of history about my experience of Bitcoin and kind of why we decided to accept it here and, and all that. So when we first started Name Hero in 2015, um, we were one of the first web hosts in the industry to actually offer uh, a Bitcoin payment solution. And this is much because of um, my own use using Bitcoin. I think it was back in 2011, I bought my first Bitcoin. And um, back then, you, you couldn't buy it. There wasn't exchanges such as Coinbase. Base, you had to um, you had to use Western Union to send money to a bank that could convert it over to you to Bitcoin, and then you had a wallet on your computer to where they transferred the funds to. And that's what I did. I just thought it was extremely um, cool and interesting that this digital um, decentralized type currency existed um, for the worldwide. Um, so I thought it was really neat. And at the time, I, I bought about two hundred dollars worth of it, um, and each Bitcoin was ten dollars. So um, you can see how quickly that that rose though um at the time i really wish i would have sunk every last penny i had into it but i, I didn't um but that was my first experience of Bitcoin, and um, then years later, I started to invest much heavier as it kind of proved itself, um, and the exchanges started to come out. Um, specifically, I started using um, Coinbase and some other exchanges out there uh, to where I would purchase Bitcoins around $300 each, and nowadays, um, as I'm publishing this post, it's probably fluctuated since um, then, but it's um, $3,900 for one Bitcoin. Um, so that really from $10 from 300 is just really insane growth. I mean, it's only been six years, um, seven years since 2011. So um, just some really insane growth from $10. Now, is Bitcoin sustainable long term? Well, I'm not going to get in that debate. Um, you know, people, some people that are behind it say yes, absolutely. People that aren't say no. Uh, you know, JP Morgan's um, CEO recently said it was a fraud or whatever he said it was. Um, some hedge fund owner said it was a bubble. It, it may be. You know, I, I think really no one really knows where Bitcoin's going to go. You know, I think in the United States here, if the um, government put their foot down and, and ban it, then it would certainly um, take a big effect to Bitcoin. I think a lot of Bitcoin is, um, you know, based on the hype. I think that's got, you know, plays a big part into it. But, um, you know, personally, I'm a believer in it. You know, I, I, I think it's... Um, it's a way that worldwide we can accept payments from people all over the world and just kind of have um, you know a set process so here at name hero offering web hosting to customers from all around the world it's one way that we can you know just offer it and, and get paid and, and without having to convert um, to usd and all that um, but again it depends who you talk to so uh, you know it is what it is um, but we're going to accept it and I, I do believe in it now i want to talk about um, our fraud process uh, bitcoin does have history with the dark web and that's that's going to come with digital currency. I mean, you know, so currency that's not you don't have in your hand that's digital. You're going to have stuff like the Silk Road come up. You're going to have um, illicit goods. You're going to have money laundering. I mean, you're going to have all sorts of things that comes with currency. I mean, that that's, that just is what it is. Um, but with that said, here at Name Hero, um, it doesn't give you a free pass to use Bitcoin to sign up with a fake account and then to go do bad stuff here at Name Hero. We don't allow adult content. We don't allow anything scammy. Um, it's really a, it's really something that I'm not going to argue with people. Um, you know, we're, it's very cut and dry here at Name Hero. We don't allow um, hate sites. We don't allow um, you know anything that we. Um, any, anything that we deem inappropriate in our terms still goes. So whether you're paying with Bitcoin or you're paying with, with um, PayPal or you're using your credit card, it's the same terms. Um, it's, it's been a, it's a myth really that Bitcoin's untraceable um, because nowadays with computers, everything is traceable. I um, mean, Coinbase does their vetting process, but at Name Hero, we will continue to do our fraud checks. And if, you know, if something looks suspicious, then we're probably going to require some more information about you and your company uh, before we'll set you up. And that's just, you know, it's, it goes along with being a web host and our responsibility to the interwebs. 
Um, so please, you know, if you're watching this video and you want to do something shady, don't do it here. Go, go somewhere else and do that. Um, finally, if you want to get a free $10, uh, you can use our referral link. And um, actually, we get $10 and you get $10 if you sign up using this link. And after you do your first um, $100 buy or sell within 180 days of opening your account, then you, know, you get some free money. And it's almost enough for a free reg domain registration. It's free, though, so I don't know why you wouldn't do it. I mean, if you're watching this video and you don't have a Coinbase account, you can sign up using this link and you're going to get a free 10 bucks. So, I mean, why not? All right. Um, it's not a lot, but it's definitely a little bit. Um, but those that aren't familiar with Coinbase, it's I compare it to people that don't have an account. It's a lot like PayPal. Um, you go through the sign-up process. You have to have a funding source, and you can actually fund it using PayPal, uh, your bank account, or your credit or debit card. Um, there might be some type of limit with a credit card, but I know debit cards um, will fund it. Um, now, there is some limits. If you don't verify your identity, then I think Coinbase limits you to how much you can um, you buy, how much Bitcoin you can buy um, each week. But if you verify your identity, which is a super easy process, they allow you just to use your webcam to take a picture of your government ID, and it's uh, super easy. So uh, that's what I recommend doing. Um, then once you have your account set up, you can use it almost just like a PayPal account. You can use it to buy stuff. Uh, you can buy Bitcoin. You can invest in it. You can sell Bitcoin. You can you can make money with it. It's it's a lot of fun. I I, I really enjoy um, Bitcoin, and um, you know it's something that it's a hobby of mine, and um, something that I'm very proud to um, get live here at Name Hero. Before I cut this video, though, I want to show you um, where it is, just so you know, on our sign up page. So let's say I wanted to sign up for a VPS server. I would navigate over here to our VPS hosting packages. Let's just say I want to do the four gigabyte. Um, I'm going to use just namehero.org. Whoops. My E key is sticking. So let's just, there we go. My E key is sticking, which is not good. Um, anyways, all right, so we're going to configure this. Um, let's just call it HTRAC, NS1, NS2. I saw Josh's name post up, went up in the host name there. That's funny. Um, okay, so you select your options if you want to, and then we're going to continue on here. You got the price and check out, and down here at the bottom. So at the bottom here, you have the option now to pay a credit card, PayPal, or Coinbase. So it's just like PayPal. When you select it and you agree the terms and you go to the next page, it's going to bring up a little dialogue. Let's see if I can get it to, well, I don't want to fill out all this right now. Um, but as soon as I complete order here, click complete order, you're going to get a pop-up dialogue with um, Coinbase. And from there, you'll just log into your account just like you would PayPal. You will authorize the transaction and, um, and then it will pay. So it will automatically convert this USD into your Bitcoin. You don't have to do any conversions or anything. It's just going to take whatever the current um, price is. Um, and so that's, it just works like that. So that's how it works. Very simple and straightforward. Um, if you're, you know, it's a recurring um, process, so it will rebuild using the subscription unless you cancel it inside of Coinbase. But uh, very similar to PayPal, but that's how it works. And we're really excited to get this out for you. Um, I know me personally, I, I wish um, I could buy more stuff with Bitcoin because I, I use it a lot online, so I definitely uh, think it's a really good benefit to have. Um, so feel free to reach out if you have any questions. Um, let us know. You can reach out um, to our sales desk, and our technicians will help you out. But other than that, enjoy using Bitcoin for your domain registrations and your web hosting. And, of course, if we can help clear anything up, just let us know. We'd be more than happy to. Thanks so much, everyone.